Hey there, it's Christine from Nurse in the Making, and today let's do some pediatric dosage calc. When it comes to pediatric dosage calc, practice is so important. So if you don't feel like a pro yet, that's okay. Just keep at it and keep practicing. Let's walk through our first example. A child weighs 20 kilograms. The prescribed dosage for amoxicillin is 50 milligrams per kilogram per day in divided doses every six hours. How many milligrams should the child receive per dose? So the prescription is 50 milligrams per kilogram per day. So we can plug in our information. 50 milligrams per kilogram times 20 kilograms equals 1,000. But to get the proper units, we can cross out kilograms, leaving us with 1,000 milligrams per day. Remember, that's what the prescription gives us here, per day. But the question asked, per dose, and the prescription is given per day. So be sure to read the entire question because 1,000 milligrams is actually wrong. We need to answer in per dose. We know the prescription is one dose every six hours. Well, that's four times per day, right? Because there's 24 hours in a day. 1,000 milligrams over one day multiplied by one day has four doses in it, we cross out the days, leaving us with 250 milligrams per dose. Hopefully it's not too bad when you break it apart, but let's do another practice question. But this time I'm gonna throw one more thing in there to make it a little harder. A child weighs 30 pounds. The prescribed dosage for acetaminophen is 15 milligrams per kilogram per dose every four hours as needed. How many milligrams should the child receive per dose? All right, time to crunch some numbers for our little patient here. So the child weighs 30 pounds, but the formula gives us milligrams per kilogram, so first we need to convert pounds to kilograms. The way you convert pounds to kilograms is to divide by 2.2. So 30 pounds times one kilogram over 2.2 pounds we then cancel out our pounds, leaving us with 13.64 kilograms. Now we can fill out our formula. So now we know our patient's weight in kilograms. The prescription is 15 milligrams per kilogram per dose. So we can plug in our information. 15 milligrams per kilogram times 13.64 kilograms equals 204.6. But to get the proper units, we can cross out kilograms, leaving us with 204.6 milligrams per dose. Now we can round this to the nearest appropriate dose option, which is 200 milligrams. Something to really pay attention to is that the other question gave us a formula per day, but this one gives it per dose. So always be sure to watch out for that wording when doing dosage count questions. So again, practice, practice, practice pediatric dosage calc questions. It's really the only way you're going to get better, so keep at it. Hopefully you understand pediatric dosage calc a little bit better. If you are in pediatrics class, you will love these flashcards. Studying using flashcards allows you to find out your knowledge deficits way before the exam. It covers developmental milestones, diseases, and pediatric anatomy. Not to mention all the visual aids like comparison charts, diagrams, pictures, and of course, memory tricks. You can find a link to these flashcards on my shop, Nurse in the Making, but of course, they're in the description below. Happy studying future nurses and to all my future pediatric nurses out there, you got this.